got a secret, can you keep it? Swear this one you save. Better lock it in your pocket, taking this one to the grave. If I show you, then I know you won't tell what I said. Cause two can keep a secret if one of them is dead. For today's Style Jacked episode, I'm recreating Aria Montgomery's look from Season 5, Episode 3. Her style reminds me of all the liars put together, so I'm really excited about this video, so let's start with hair. I have really short hair, so I'm grabbing my VP Fashion hair extensions, which I mentioned in my Emily Fields Style Jacked video, and I'm just going to quickly apply the clips into my hair and curl my hair with the extensions. I'll have a coupon code for these extensions in the description box if anyone is interested. Now that the hair is done, let's move on to makeup. I'm priming my face with Benefit's Stay Flawless Primer and this is going to help the foundation we apply last longer. Now with Tarte's Amazonian Clay Foundation and a damp beauty blender, I'm going to blend the foundation into my skin. And I love this foundation because it really helps give my face that flawless look just like Aria's. To highlight and conceal, I'm using Phys 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 Physicians Formula Nude Wear Glow. <laughs> I can't talk today. If you apply liquid or cream products to your face, you have to be sure to set it. And here, I'm using L'Oreal's True Match Powder to set my face. To add some depth to my face, I'm taking Benefit's Hoola Bronzer, which is my favorite because it's like the best thing ever, and then applying Glow Minerals Blush in Bronze to match the same flush that Aria had in her cheeks. Aria's brows are always very strong and bold, so I'm using my Anastasia Brow Genius Kit. Anastasia, Anastasia, say it however you want. But this stuff is so cool because it comes with a loose brow powder and a gel wand, and you just mix the two together and make your own special little brow potion. And uh, you use that to fill in your brows, and this kit always makes my brows look so perfect, and they are just really really awesome so if you're looking to step up your brow game this is definitely the kit to get cuz you know eyebrows on fleek for the eyes I'm using benefits creaseless cream shadow in RSVP and applying that onto my lid and inner corners to act as a base as well as highlight the inner part of our eyes for eyeshadow I'm gonna be using the urban decay original naked palette yeah, I know, mine looks super beat up and I ripped off the gold lettering. I don't know why I did that. But I am taking the color Sidecar and applying that onto my lid. Then with the color Buck, I'm going to blend that into my crease. With Dark Horse, I'm using that to darken up the crease. And lastly, I'm taking Creep to really smoke out the eyes and also drag that color onto my lower lash line. I'm feathering the color out towards the tail of my brow just like this to kind of match the same eyeshadow look that Aria had. Now I'm just lining my upper and lower lash line with a little bit of eyeliner and here I'm using my NYX gel liner and a small angled brush. Now just curl your lashes and apply generous coats of mascara and our eyes are complete. Finishing up this look with the lips, I'm taking NYX Peekaboo Lip Liner and just lining my lips and filling them in. And I'm also going to draw a little bit outside my natural lip line to fake fuller lips because you know I got little tiny baby lips. <laughs> Last but not least, let's move on to the outfit. So like I mentioned earlier, Aria's style is really unique and it reminds me of every style of the liars mashed together into one character. I don't know if that makes sense or not, but basically Aria is our little wild one when it comes to fashion because you never really know what to expect. One day she may be dark and grungy and the next she's super preppy and colorful. Nonetheless, her looks are always so fun and so is this one that I recreated. I found a similar blazer to hers from boohoo.com and it was super affordable too. I had a similar striped dress in my closet that I found from Forever 21 a long time ago and the belt I've also had for a long time and I think I actually found it at the thrift store. My pink bracelet is from Target in the kids section and my necklace is from Express. I think the most expensive thing in this look is the shoes, which were actually under $40, so that's still super inexpensive, but I found these babies from Marshalls, and I'm kinda in love with them, I'm not gonna lie. So that's it for this Aria Montgomery Style Jacked video. I really hope you enjoyed and it would mean so much to me if you would share this video with Lucy Hale. Just click the link in the description box and yeah, let's see what else. 
Don't forget to subscribe so you don't miss out on any videos. I upload every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. You can give this video a thumbs up if you love Pretty Little Liars, and you can check out my previous video by clicking the picture here or the link in the description. Thanks again for watching. I love you guys so, so much, and I'll see you guys on Wednesday. Bye, have a magical day.